the jail. And the fans are on their feet awaiting the start of this game as the players line up for the kick. Sends it sailing downfield. And they can forget about returning this one. Wildcats in talking with them this week, Kirk. It's just interesting their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself. And I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him the football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I, I'll be shocked if they can slow him down. So the sack makes this a second and long. A wide receiver screen play, and he's tackled at the 19. The D sniffs out the screen pass and holds him to a short game. Contain, contain, contain. That's the only way you can shut down a guy with 4 2 speed. the catch to the 20 the 10 and a huge touchdown play he splits the uprights with the extra point it was a quick three-play, 76-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Well, Brad, right now this offense is hot, and they also took advantage of some mistakes there by the defense. The score now, 7-0. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. the stop around the 32 yard line. That'll bring up second and three. Second down and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Second down. Yep, it was good enough to get him the first down. That's just a nice play. From the 50, first down. He's going to air it long. Finds the junior. Touchdown, Kansas. Will be tied with the extra point. And he converts the extra point. Kansas ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This offense did really well with the air attack on their last trip out there. Let's see if they can do the same thing here. <laughs> this offensive coordinator has got to be feeling so good about the execution he's seeing from this quarterback and his wide receiver. Because, again, they put so much. And now the ball is loose. And the defense is on it. Tackle the 25-yard line. And that's exactly what this defense was looking for. Yeah, that fumble gives these guys some added life. Now let's see if they can capitalize off of it. Well, they had a lot of success on their last possession, and now they're going to start this one off with excellent field position. It's hard to ask your defense to come out and make a stop when they're already backed up this far within their own end zone. Quick throw. Let's see if this coaching staff sticks with the short passing game, or if they decide to open it up a bit more. Makes it second and eight. From the 
the 23 yard line. Second down. He's looking for his man. Quick strike and it's caught for the touchdown. Yeah, they saw something upstairs. It led to a touchdown. You can thank the play calling there. Very impressive. They got great concentration from everyone to connect on that flag pattern. So they're going to try to determine if the receiver had possession and was inbounds or not. So the referee initially calls it a catch, but we'll get a second look at it here and determine if he was inbounds when he hauled it in. And that play happened so fast that it was very tough to tell if he was able to get a foot down or not. The, play, the ruling on the field stands. After review, they decided that the call on the field will stand. Kansas with a six-point lead. And he adds the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. A fumble ended this offense's last drive. Let's see as they come out on the field what they'll do this time around. One general rule in any game is to hold on to the ball. If you're in the negative in the turnover department, your chances of winning decrease exponentially. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 25. Gets it out quickly. Out of bounds. That's the 28. That makes it 37. Gets out to about the 31. Three yards there on the delayed handoff. This one is a beauty. Fielded at the 19. Brought down at the 26. The Jayhawks really taking care of business early in this football game. Yeah, somebody forgot to tell them that they're the big underdog in this game and they're supposed to lose. I love their confidence that they're playing with right now. The offense will come out again hoping to have similar results as their last drive. This quarterback right now is in a rhythm, and a lot of that has to do with his preparation. You can see right now that the reads that he's being able to make, getting the football out of his hands, but he's feeling very, very confident in his ability to throw the football against this team. They're about four yards away here on second down. Kansas is up seven. Now he tries to buy some time. He's tackled at about the 49. And he has a huge gain. Yeah, I like the decision-making ability of this quarterback. He looks and looks. He sees nothing. He didn't get rattled. He sees some green in front of him, and he takes off. Ends up with a great run. you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Red, two, green, 15. Quick throw, and he's got the tight end again. Call it a gain of one yard. That'll make it 39. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 41. 29, 29. He's out of bounds at the 48. That'll make it fourth and six. This punt, if he gets it where he wants it, can really change the field position of this football game. It's away, and it's a booming punt. 
And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. And he's taken down around the 21-yard line. It's second and nine. Ball on their own 21. Quick throw out to the receiver. Brought down around the 38-yard line. That's good for a gain of 17 yards. That makes it first and 10. First and 10. Ball on the 38-yard line. Talk about scoring a huge first quarter by both teams. 14-7, Kansas. Back to the action now here in the second quarter. Ready! And they get him in the backfield for a loss. The defense was just all over that play. It didn't fool anybody. From their own 39-yard line. Third down. Five wide. He's at midfield. Great concentration to haul it in. They'll bring him down at the 42. First down. Made around the 36 yard line. Call it a gain of six yards. That'll make it second and four. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Catches it, and he's looking for more. And down he goes at the 21. That's good for a gain of 15 yards. First down. Here's the eighth play of the series. He gets another carry. Second and three. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. I got number 18. I got you, 18. Run. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. The offense knows that the linebackers are cheating up a little bit on the run. They can get some protection. They might want to open up a little bit of space for some passes underneath. This is the 10th play of this drive. Delivers to the halfback on the screen. Knocked out of bounds at the six. But as you just saw right there, the screen pass can be a very effective weapon for an offense, especially when they're disciplined and when the receivers are patient. A touchdown away from a tie. Ready! Black hat! And they got him for a loss. There's nothing better than having an athletic, 
versatile and instinctive safety. He makes a big time play here with his recognition of the run, comes up and does what he does best, which is making a nice short tackle on the ball carrier. Here's the 12th play of the drive. He gets rid of this one. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. They'll be looking for the end zone here. Third and goal from the nine. Pressure coming. He brings it down. Touchdown. These guys need to be aware this aerial attack is capable of making some big plays. They've got to get on their toes. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. He makes the PAT. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. Set, Ten Boston! Ten Boston! Makes the catch and look out. He gets hit out of bounds at the 29. It's second and six. Ball on the 29-yard line. He's under pressure. Complete brought down, nothing doing. That'll make it third and five. Here we go, here we go. Fires that quickly, incomplete. And that'll bring up a punting situation. The defense held their ground on that play. The quarterback just wasn't able to find any open receivers. These special teams have done it before, blocking punts. It looks like they're coming after this one. Oh, excellent punt. Pretty good job by the return man there. They've been like a couple of fighters feeling each other out so far. Let's see if they start to open it up a little bit more now. Now he's scrambling. And now he's going to run. He's to the 40. And he's tackled at the 47. That makes it first and 10. From their own 47-yard line, it's first down. Three down, three down. Hey, Mike, 52. Red 88. Red 88. Red 88. Motion, 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 motion. Red 88. He's going to try and scramble. Diving for extra yardage. So the keeper goes for about seven yards. Kansas State will take a timeout. That's their first of the half. Make the stop, the 39-yard line. They get about seven yards on the pass and pick up a first down. And how about the poise of this quarterback to locate his receiver, pass the sticks, and get him the ball? That was a great throw. He scrambled, runs with it, and he's got room. Decides to slide, and he got about six on that little scramble. Kansas State's going to have to use their second time out of the half. They're about four yards away here on second down. Let's go! He's scrambling. He's taken down around the 30-yard line. Three yards there on the quarterback keeper. Great play by the senior linebacker to step up in traffic and make that tackle. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. First down, Graham. That's a great tackle at the 25. Green, 
He's on the run. He's wrapped up for the sack. Man, these guys can be aggressive. When you stand back there and take hits like that, you definitely are going to feel it the next day. Darts it to the left. And it's going the other way. Good decision there. Why do you even throw that pass? Well, it's a good job by the corner of sitting back and reading the quarterback's eyes. Good job of disguising coverage as well. From their own seven yard line, first down. He makes it to the nine. That's a gain of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. Two times, two times. We played a half. We're deadlocked right now at 14. We played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 halftime show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Well, we say it here all the time. It's not always about the X's and the O's. It can be about the Jimmy's and, and the, the Joe's. Joe's. But I think Jimmy and Joe appear to be pretty evenly matched here. And this might not necessarily be about who has the better athlete, who has the more explosive player. This might come down to which guy maneuvering those X's and O's does so the most wisely. Well, who's telling Jimmy and Joe where to line up? <laughs> they got to they gotta know where they're <laughs> supposed to go. So I think it is important. And the coaches, sometimes you got to break character. You know, sometimes you know you're a predominantly run team, and that's what you do, and you're going to line up and pound it. But sometimes you face a good defense that's playing really well that they're not going to allow you to do that. And sometimes you got to get a little bit out of character. And I think which offense or which defense can take a few chances and get rewarded for those chances. Come up on the plus side of it, create a big turnover, set your offense up on the right side of it. How about you dial up one of those trick plays you got in your bag that you haven't used in a while that you think might could, might could work and might could maybe bust open this game and give you a little bit of separation. David and I will stay locked in on everything going on in college football. We're gonna wrap it up here in the studio. Just about time to get you out to your second half. Brad and Kirk, ready with a call. Well, Reese and David, I know you're jealous. This is the kind of games you guys like to do. But that's Thursday night. This is the big show. I think it says something about the quality of the preparation of both teams that we're into the third quarter and nobody's been able to pull away. Both sides seem to know what to expect. Around the 23 yard line. The option is all about timing, and on that play, the timing was just off. That's going to happen sometimes. Second down and 12. Ball on the 23 yard line. Caught with room to work. He's brought down in the open field. A seven yard gain that time from the play action pass completion. Quick strike to the receiver. He's tackled at the 40 yard line. From their own 40 yard line. First down. Defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down to the sack. And somehow, he's able to throw the ball away. They go back to him on the quick throw. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. That makes it third and three. They'll line it up again on third down. Here we go. Here we go. I got the go. Here he goes. Gains his way to the 43-yard line. He's got an opening. Gets out. 
to around the 32. This is the eighth play of this drive. Across the middle, intercepted. And he hits him hard, the 37-yard line. He telegraphed that throw. He eyed his receiver the whole way. That was an easy read by the defense. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 37-yard line. No, 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 check that, check that. We got Mike 50. He makes it out to maybe the 39-yard line. That makes it second and eight. Larry, Larry, Larry. My 52, my 52. I got you, I got you. Fired quickly and he's got his man. And he's taken down at the 42-yard line. That's a team of three. That'll make it 35. Third and five, ball on the 42. Fires incomplete. He had to get rid of that one in a hurry. The defensive coordinator cooked up a good blitz package that time, and although it didn't result in a sack, it forced a bad throw. You don't want to squander any possessions, but maybe now's the right time to dip into your bag of tricks a little. Think about some gadget plays to catch the defense napping. Complete. He's got room. He made a really good move at the line of scrimmage. Sometimes all you need to do is throw off the defender's timing just a little bit at the start of the play. From midfield, it's first down. And he tackles him hard at the 48-yard line. Well, the question now is, how will they respond after losing a couple on that run? They'll get him for a loss. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 40. Tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. Mike six. Mike two. Green eight. And he's going to come up with a sack. Boy, Brad, that was a big hit on the quarterback. I'm going to be interested to see how he responds from this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive linemen and challenges them to start playing a little bit better. The sack makes this a fourth and very long. It's away, and it's a booming punt. They'll take it from the 18. They bring him down, and they bring him down hard on that one. Decent effort. He's not the type of guy to call a fair catch very often. He does have the ability to make guys miss. Now's when you start to approach each drive, thinking that if you take the lead, then the momentum you gain feels that much more powerful. And they push him out around the 40-yard line. First down. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 40-yard line. You got nothing today. You got nothing. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. That's good for a game of three yards. That makes, that makes it second, second and six. six. Woo! 
from their own 43 yard line. It's second down. Caught out of the open. I think he's going to go to his tight end the whole way, but the defense didn't expect it. Sometimes those big guys can fool defenders into thinking they're blocking. And he's level at the 36 yard line. Number 52 brings him down at the 36 yard line. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Yeah, let's go sack lunch. Come on, you won eight. Let's go! Rosen, watch out. Oh, almost had a pick. It can be tough making a play on the ball sometimes, but that's probably a pick he should have made. Gains his way to the 23-yard line. The defense doesn't seem to have an answer right now. They might need to change up some of their schemes. From the 23-yard line, first down. Black 90! Black 90! So with one quarter remaining, 14 apiece. Just about set to get back to the action here in quarter number four in a tie ball game. Watch 52. 52 the mic. He's scared. Got a man. Watch out here. Brought down at the 12. Makes the reception. Number 47 on the tackle. From the 12-yard line. First down. First down. Ready. Blue 80. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. And that was the sophomore linebacker there who was able to get in and make that tackle. This is the ninth play of this drive. one-yard line. First and goal as they look to take the lead. So he decides to hold on to it, and it goes nowhere. And this is the 11th play of the current drive. Oh, yeah, I'm coming. Oh, yeah, I'm coming. Now he tries to buy some time. And he can't get away from the pressure. Here we go. Third and goal from the three-yard line. Down right around the two-yard line. Looks like someone got a head start on the line. False start. Offense. Just a middle lapse, but it's going to cost them five yards. Still fourth down. Fourth down. This one should be makeable. He gets it up, and he's got it. And with that, all the pressure now shifts back to the other side. That's what a good kicker can do. Kansas State ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Both teams are kind of struggling to take control of this game. Obviously, they're both very, very competitive with one another. It just seems that the lead is going back and forth between the two teams. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. There's a strike complete. Tackle made right around the four. Right 
First and ten. Ball on their own 40. Fires quickly to the tight end. And he's tackled the 47-yard line. He made a good read here to find his teammate. That's sound decision making. Just under three to go in regulation. Scrambling around. And they make the stop at the 34-yard line. From the 34-yard line, it's first down. He's at the 20. Down to the open field. First down. Here's the halfback on the screen. He's knocked out of bounds around the 13-yard line. Gain of two on the play. From the 13-yard line, second down. Check five, check five, five, six, five, six. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Orange three, orange three. He fights forward to about the 13. Slings it quickly to his halfback again. That play was designed to pick up a first down, but they didn't do it. It looks like the receiver just lost track of where he was on the field. It's fourth down. They're going to go for the easy three here. It's up, and it's good. This game seems to get better and better with every play. These guys are really leaving it all out on the field tonight. Kansas kicked this one off. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Late in the fourth quarter, tie football game. An important game for both these teams, and this is where you find out who your leaders are. A little over a minute in the game. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. He's taken down around the 29-yard line. That's a gain of four on the play. Check 99. That makes it second and six. Tackle at the 42. Boy, this is just outstanding execution by the quarterback and the wide receiver. I mean, you look at that throw and you think, oh, my gosh, what are you doing? You're throwing that into coverage. But only he knows the confidence that he has in his wide receiver to have the ability to come down with the football for that first down. That's big time there between the quarterback and the wide receiver. Second and four. Ready! Green, Green, But hot! Easy, 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 easy! Omaha! But hot! Omaha! He's going to try and scramble. He's tackled right around the 42-yard line. The Wildcats will use their first time out of the half. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 42-yard line. Now he's scrambling. Slides down to the ground. And they picked up four yards on the scramble. Kansas State's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Over, over, over. 
Good open field tackle. Number three makes the catch. Gain of six yards. That makes it first and ten. He scrambles, runs with it, and he's got room. We're going to overtime. Well, we've had fun, folks, but we're not done yet because this game is heading to overtime. And we're back ready now for overtime. Check Mike, check Mike. Red Mike, two. Mike, six. Red seven, red seven. Hit. Go. Gets it out to his receiver and he can't hang on. Number three, the intended receiver on the way. That makes it second and ten. From the 25 yard line, it's second down. I'm on, I'm on. Red. And he is drilled at the 15. Play, and now they're in a great position to score. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. And the end zone touchdown. It's first and ten. Ball on the twenty five. on that one. This defense is fast enough that they can create negative yards on completed passes. So the offense might want to consider that next time they try that play. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. Number 14 on the tackle at the 24-yard line. That'll, That'll make, make it 39. 39. We go to work. Third down, and they need to get it to the 15. Tight right, tight right. Strip the ball. Strip that ball. Take four, take four. And he might want it all here and does. He's in. Touchdown, K State. It's a nice touchdown, but they still need the extra point to tie it up. It's a lot of pressure on a kicker. You never know about the jitters. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. He makes the PAT. We've got a dandy here, folks. We're heading to overtime number two. First and 10, ball on the 25-yard line. Knocked out immediately after the catch. That's a game of 17. That makes it first and goal. Touchdown. 
So the offense steps up and gets a big six points here in double overtime. And that gives them some breathing room for the time being. But I'll tell you, the way this game is being played, I wouldn't be surprised if we saw this offense on the field again in a third overtime. And he converts the extra point. From the 25-yard line, first down. Mike six. Mike six. Throws it to the halfback on the screen. And he's taken down at the 23. Call it a gain of two yards. That makes it second and eight. What was that? Are you kidding me? Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 23 yard line. him hard at the 16. Push him out around the nine yard line. Call it a game of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Blue 20. He's on the run. Brought down at the six yard line. Gain of three yards. That'll bring up third. They're about four yards away here on third down. Check Mike, check Mike, Mike six, Mike six. Red two. They hand it off. The defense is having a difficult time stopping this drive. Right now, they're doing enough to be in situations they want to be in, but they have to finish the job. And the plays start to add up, so we'll have to see if this defense starts to look tired out there. And he just gets rid of it. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. And this play is number eight on the drive. Defense in their short yardage package. And down he goes, just outside the goal line. No game. That makes it dirty goal. We've got third and goal. Ball on the one. Mike six. Mike six. And he's level at the one. Gain of a yard by the fullback. That's good for a gain of one yard. That brings us to the ball. one's in the books and we saw a great one here today kansas state 31 kansas 24. kirk go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game you just can't underestimate a team when they're your rival when today's game proved that and nothing stings more than losing to the one team you want to beat in overtime Another game of NCAA Football 14 for Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports. Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.